first two bits. Well, it's a rare condition this day and age to any good news. Fuck. Never mind. I'm not doing it now. So, <laughs> good morning and welcome to. I really, I really just clapping. wanted to do clapping at Bob's. I really just wanted to do. Well, then there's must be some kind of clue inside these gentle walls. That's all I wanted to do. That's, all, that's good. That's all we needed. That's all I want to do. Is that a double okay. I just exploded on the inside. <laughs> Too much mozzarella. Inside huh? the uh, gentle, gentle walls. Inside inside walls. These gentle, these gentle balls. I mean walls. <laughs> you guys are all whiskeyed up. <laughs> Breakfast is weird, y'all. <laughs> hey, uh, I may have said good morning, but um, it's actually eight twenty-seven on Thursday night. Um, I'm one it's of your hosts, breakfast. Krini Zakovrak, sitting across from me, Mister Stephen E. Macarak, Stephen E. Okay. Well, I was gonna go Bert Bakarak. Well, you're his brother, Bert Bakarak, Bob Bakarak. Bert Bob Bacharach. the the guy who produced. Well, what did he do? He did a he made a bunch of songs. He's an he? EGOT. Huh? Bert Bacharach's an EGOT. What's that? He's got an Emmy, a Grammy, an Oscar, and a Tony. Oh, oh that guy. Whoa. Does uh does Quincy Jones have all yes. of those things? Yep. Yeah, I would. Think. It was EGOT was one of the answers on Jeopardy last night. Nice. And so I fucking had to look up all the people who are EGOTs. And it's it's a pretty impressive list. I was about <laughs> to be mad if if Quincy Jones wasn't. Yeah. Barbara Streisand is an honorary EGOT. Random fact. So um it's the only one I remember. What do we have for breakfast, Steve? What uh hold on. An Emmy okay. is what well an Emmy is for what? Television. Exactly. Television. The Grammy's music. Mm-hmm. Um, an Oscar is movies and a Tony is stage. Yes. Yes. You're on it. You got okay. it. Okay. Okay. Or you as we it. like, as we in the industry like to call it, Broadway. 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 You know who are almost EGOTs? They're missing one award. Nick Kroll. They are. And John Mulaney. <laughs> they. <laughs> That's not me. <laughs> they are missing an Oscar. So they're eggs. I believe they're missing an Oscar. Is Trey Parker and Matt Stone? They have a Tony. They have a. Uh, I'm pretty sure they have a Grammy, and I'm pretty sure they have the Emmy. Well, when you write when you write the song "I'm Horny All Night Long," <laughs> so the Emmy is obviously for South Park. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But the Tony and the Oscar, I'm pretty sure uh, they you got the Grammy, not the Oscar. Uh, fuck. What is it? Was it Cannibal? It could be Cannibal the Musical, or it could be the Book of Mormon. It's the Book of Mormon. Yep, Book of Mormon. Deidre didn't know that. Deidre didn't know that that was them. Yeah, she knew of <laughs> Book of Mormon because she's big into theater. But she knew who Trey Park. Well, she didn't actually know theater. Who, she knew who the guys who created South Park were. I bet if I but move this, it falls. They were one the same, but I want it. I don't understand. We need a different table, Steve. Yeah, you're probably right. I just need this. I just need more lip. Yeah. Give me, hey boy, if you give me when lip. You cut this table. How many times did you measure each side? I didn't measure any of it. <laughs> you didn't what? I didn't measure a thing. You didn't I don't measure. measure. No, it, this was. I didn't even cut anything or nothing. I just. <laughs> it was already there. I. Uh, that's just a piece of MDF with felt. It's nice. This was a metal palette. And the legs were another metal pallet this was that I D&D just table. basically <laughs> hot glued on the bottom. I was actually going to ask, do you guys game on this? Yeah, we have. Um, <clears throat> guest since uh, we didn't been a while. Ooh, a twenty point. Yeah, twenty on my giant size on my dire dice. Almost, almost on that one too. Awesome. Could you project a little more? A little bit more. A little bit more. A little bit more. A little bit more. A little so, bit more. Um. I'm going to Indiana this weekend for my little sister's graduation party, so that's what we're recording on Thursday. Um, I'd like to welcome our guest, first timer, um, James Jim the Sound Guy Sayers Hello. to the podcast. Hey. Welcome. Well, thanks for having me. You're allowed to clap for yourself. Too. A little bit. Well, clap. 
I, I just, uh, you know, want to encourage the self love. Yes. Self love. Oh, self-care. trust me. I am, I am well versed in self love. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what you were doing when you, you video called me. You were playing a little pocket pool so I could see it. I mean, huh? You know, was, I thought that looked strange for the inside of a pocket. <laughs> it was very red. Are that the was Bob. That, red? that was for, for your eyes only. I can't believe you're showing people. <laughs> he had it on speakerphone. Oh man! Well, it was a video, so uh-huh. you could have put headphones in. And then I called, like, "Oh, did did I accidentally call y- you? Uh, was that <laughs> was oops? Did I oops? Did I do that? <laughs> I like looked and I was like, why is it on? And I'm like, did 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 Bob call me? <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> All right, cool. I was trying to it's watch. Me. I was trying to watch some D and D stuff, and he interrupted me. That's all right. Not a big deal. That's like the one time uh, I was at Riot Fest and I was leaving. And uh, who the hell was it? What's the band from Chicago that everybody likes that I hate? Is it Good Charlotte or is it Fall Out Boy? <laughs> Fall Out Boy. And like, so I would put them in the same category too. I funny. I just came from like. Uh, there was this embarrassing Danzig set, and then half of it was was the Misfits. Like, uh, like everyone's leaving. Every, every, like all these people in in like these skull Danzig sh- like shirts and hoodies are leaving because it was just that bad. It, it seemed like a cover band, and he was like doing way too many ad way too many ad libs. Everything was whoa, like yeah, yeah, like everything. <laughs> so, so then should I? Well, I know there's a, a ton of yeah. Misfits and Danzig cover sets out there, but should I start the premiere one? Should I, I be? I would think that the yes. new age of it. Right yeah. now, you're you're a better Danzig than Danzig. But <laughs> and I don't eat I, my own. I don't eat my own cum, hot dogs, or smoke weed. So do you drink blood from a skull while petting your <laughs> pet wolf? Lestalic. <laughs> no, no Hitler books in your library. I do. Yeah, that's no. Nope. That's always a downer. But uh, I hope not. So do you, do you wear fishnet t-shirts while crawling through <laughs> tubes with flashing? <laughs> <laughs> no. I would never wear a fishnet shirt. You should, man. Do no. you just start wearing fishnet shirts all the time? <laughs> There's a bunch of pictures of me. Like used to, <laughs> I used to work at Hot Topic, man. Come on, <laughs> you just, that's, that's the dress code. You just took them off of the the displays. <laughs> so, before we get into it, should we try this cheese? Let's try that fucking cheese. Let me cleanse my palate. <laughs> yeah, cleanse your palates. Whiskey or water. I'm gonna. It is uh, from Mars Castle, Cheese Castle, in uh, somewhere in Wisconsin. Describe it. Describe it. It's very orange and dry. It looks dry as hell. Very I can. Orange. I can imagine. I can imagine when you bite into this, it's going to dry your mouth out. Do you know how cheese is made? Like, have you ever watched? How I've only is made? watched how mozzarella is made. I watched how maggot cheese was made. Mm. That sounds intense. That sounds fucking gross. It's uh the the maggots they like eat it and then shit it out and then it's like they mm-hmm. process it in a way that gives it a certain flavor, a nice tangy flavor. This is probably about to be pretty tangy. Smelly I'm not like crazy about. Cheddar. Oh look, it's got a rind on it still. Oh, there's probably some rind. Yeah, a little bit. You already oh, fucking took a bite. Smell it. It's starting to sweat. You know, you yeah. get the cheese sweat. Smell it. It smells like butt. Yeah. It smells Ooh. like taint. It smells like an old piece of cheddar cheese. <laughs> That's 15 years. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. It's crunchy. There it is salt. It needs salt. Did you say it needs salt? No, no. I said I think that is yeah. salt. The crunch. Um, it's just an intense. It has to do with enzymes, actually. Man, yeah. It's just an intense. Um, cheese it. No, it just got really quiet. Yeah, what happened? Did your did is your there air conditioner, conditioner kicked just off? Finally, turn off. Probably. God, it sounds great. Oh yeah, now. yeah, it sounds amazing now. Oh man! You need to just stop turning your conditioner on. Should I turn it on? No, 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 no! Now I really sound like I'm. I got a lot of fucking echo going on. Yeah, there's this. This dungeon is not one for recording. Boom. Anyhow, it's just a real intense cheese. It. Yeah, it's a little soft for a cheese. It. Oh my god! You know it's what? A really a, the, intense, soggy cheese. The flavor. This is from <laughs> cheese. It. You know, this is. This is post bowl cheese it cereal. Post bowl <laughs> cheese it cereal. Yeah. 
you may be the only person in the room that will get this. Do you, do you know Lingua Ignata? Mm-mm. All right, never mind then. Try it out. Crazy, like, ambient, uh, industrial, experimental, weird stuff. No. Uh, operatic. Uh, but she's super dark, and, like, her early album is about, like, survival. Like, I don't know, it's like, abuse and survival and stuff. And then she is obsessed with cheese. its It's like, just breaks character. There, there is no, like... <laughs> That's beautiful. Cheez Its are Dark. Cheez Its are a totally valid coping mechanism. <laughs> You're not wrong. So the silence that we're experiencing right now reminds me I've been like slowly listening to our first few episodes. And I just want to remind everybody what those sound like. It sounds like we're just talking like this. This is this is kind of driving me crazy because I really miss that that atmosphere behind me. Don't fucking do it, Steve. Don't. I could just turn the fan on. No. You need it to be silent. Now I can hear everybody's mouth noises even better. We could put a sun record on in the background. It just plays the <laughs> no, entire time. No. <laughs> Fifteen minutes later, that song won, baby. We're done. Minutes. Sure, I could. I could. Just That's a little it short, isn't it? No problem. <laughs> That's a little short. I know you can because you can control your your fucking air conditioner from your phone. Man, that's impressive. This is I, like I just got a, a nest, the learning the thermostat. Future. I'm gonna say that's this is cheese. that's pretty it's excellent. good. Yeah. One pe- one I like know. inch by inch and a half piece is good enough. Yeah, I think I ate too much. Man. I would like it on a cracker. Mm. Mm. A club cracker. Oh, with, a with club cracker like is some best. jam. Like a fig jam. I can't mm. decide if I want a beer with that or or Ooh, a wine. Oh yeah. You could put it in the whiskey's or. pretty good. Yeah, what about whiskey? You could put it as a garnish on your beer, mm. like a fucking Miller Lite. <laughs> <laughs> do you need another Miller piece? Lite? Deserves I do another a craft piece. single. Yeah. Oh, Miller Lite. I guess you are right. Miller Lite is the craft singles of the beer world. <laughs> but this time, chew away from the mic. <laughs> That's too quiet in here. Hey, Steve, <laughs> what? I- What'd you do this week? Okay, so I brought a show and tell. I oh, know that's why I asked you. This I is really my know what you're this is my show and tell that's been here for fucking two weeks. It's aging more. It's yeah. almost a sixteen year. It's year. fifteen. It's fifteen and two weeks old. It's my emergency first aid kit. Nice. Do you have meds in there? Is that what your pill contains? Um, there's ibuprofen and Benadryl and some floss. <laughs> You That's could do great. a lot of things with floss. That's wonderful. You could, yeah. You, you could, could garrotta stitch man. somebody you up could, if you needed to. <laughs> you could. Uh, you got a variety of ointments. You got Neosporin and A&D. Uh, antibiotic with pain relief. Okay. And anti-itch hydrocortisone. Beautiful. Some waterproof uh, tape. Wonderful. Wow. Have you ever used that kind of tape? No. It fucking, it's cool, but also it just bunches up on itself. Well, I bought uh, I brought some scissors along too in okay. case I need to cut a bunch of tape. Nice, nice. Some alcohol pads. I'm left handed, so drunk? scissors are just worthless to me. Well, I think that these are ambidextrous. Yeah, but it's it's me, and I'm bad at things. <laughs> <laughs> oh, just blame it on your hands. That's a valid way to do things. Just blame everything on your hands. Oh yeah, I'm just um, left handed. So there's a bunch of bandages in there. Can't do this. Some Q-tips, nice. What do you pair of tweezers for? I don't know, man. But they're yeah, a good, uh, they're a good excuse to have a, a rubber band in there too, because you never know when you need one. Yeah, tourniquet. They're for installing microchips in the back of your brain. Uh, I'm in. Uh, what the fuck? Chip have you me been up. Watching? I've been reading the internet, man. You know. <laughs> oh, it's the five G. QAnon, man. QAnon. Wait, so oh Q-tips are five G? Five G compatible? No, the virus or the vaccine is. Activated, activated by, yeah. by 5G, which gets shoved in your nose from the Q-tips. From the Q-tips, man. I know it from the fucking Q-tips. So I've been doing. I've been putting them in my butt. You've been doing it all wrong, man. Your ass enzymes break down a nice the chip. To take tonight. It's in a waterproof case <laughs> that you just broke. Well, it's all fucking broke now. There goes fucking Steve show and tell. Okay. Is that all you did this week was just build your fucking show Pretty much. Up? I worked. It's oh. hot. Okay, I got girls, a lot of talk school. Talk amongst yourselves. Hold on. I'll be right back. Are you going to poop? 
No. You can go straight your pants. You go blow my nose. <gasps> There's been a lot of statistics. That pizza was excellent.